It is Tuesday, November 5, 2019. Vice President Mahmoud Baumia has come to Old Fadama. He has a high-powered delegation of government ministers following him. The entire slum is at a standstill. Thousands have come to meet him in pomp and pageantry. Mr. Baumia says he is the first sitting vice president to have come to the slum. Valentina is in the crowd too. The lives of the people of Agboboloshi matter as much as the lives of the people of East Legon or Cantonments. The vice president is on a promising spree. Washrooms, toilets and bathhouses, he says, would be built in the days that will follow his visit. In all, you may see eight unit toilets, four eight unit toilets, eh, 32 toilets in all among the people of Agogu. Community center high, eh, say, um, a she, a hassle, na, mudimo, a juma, dear, waha. Community meetings, enti nana kufwa do se yense si saas community centre yi emmamo enye no story building ne emmamo so that no wait me ai enye mujuma wo community centre. The government has also put in its budget for 2019 a hostel facilities where kayaers will sleep and is going to set up a scheme to train more than 10,000 kayaers to start their own businesses. It's been two years. None of that has happened. You didn't honor even one of those promises. Once you make up a promise to do something, and based on the basis of which people vote for you, there is the reason for you to come back and honor that promise. So if you don't do it, as any normal human being will feel, it's bad. As Ghanaians who pay tax, the, 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 there is the need for those basic amenities to be provided for them. You cannot promise and you are not doing anything. And we are following you. You just come and give her 20 CD, 20 CD, receive it. Sometimes everybody will vote in Danwa, top points now, they are my age. Because we said we should continue the work. We shouldn't change any work. So we, you don't want our lives to be changed so that we should continue to carry the kaya. The kaya, we do something my son, we should be here. And to our mother, we never believe. At the main lorry station inside Abubulushi, more cars have arrived from northern Ghana. On board, more girls. Many of them tell me they are here to do kayai. And the conditions they live in when they come here is worsening. <laughs> 